Hi everybody, I hope you're well. I'm here to read you a story today. It's called Slow Loris and it's one of my favourites. Get comfortable and off we go. As you can see, the story is written by Alexis Deacon, who also wrote Bigu. It's a story you came across in year one. Here's Slow Loris. Slow Loris lives in a zoo, though he didn't care for it much. Slow Loris wasn't his real name, but that's what everyone called him. A slow Loris was just a type of animal. Slow Loris was a slow Loris. He really was very slow. It took Loris 10 minutes to eat a satsuma. Twenty minutes to get from one end of his branch to the other. And an hour to scratch his bottom. <gasps> Most of the time though, he just hung around sleeping. The visitors all thought Loris was boring. The other animals thought so too, but he didn't care. Loris had a secret. At night, when all the other animals were sound asleep, Loris got up and did things fast. Until he was so tired, he couldn't do another thing. One night, when Loris was busy doing particularly noisy things, bang, bang, clang, bang, <gasps> he was discovered. News of Loris's secret life spread quickly. Next evening, the whole zoo gathered outside the slow Loris cage. Sure enough, when it was really dark, out came Loris. The other animals were amazed. Loris wasn't boring at all. He was really wild. That night, they all did wild things together. Until they were all so tired, not one of them could do another thing. Next day, all the animals were slow. Boring, said the visitors. But like Loris, they didn't care. Now they had a secret too. And that is the end of the story. I hope you enjoyed it and I look forward to reading another one soon. Take care everybody. Bye bye.